For a lot of people in Arizona, the weekend means one thing, golf. If you're not a fan of those early morning tea times, at least one group in Arizona has found their way around that. Cronkite News reporter Maxine Park shed some light on a pastime that has moved from the brink of dawn to twilight. Nice ball. As the sun goes down here in the valley, the lights on the golf course turn on. And the golfers come out to play. Oh, it's way better at night. Night golf is an Arizona sport. This isn't serious at all, so, you know, we're just out here to have fun. Held almost all year round, well, because it's the desert. I mean, it's 106 in the day, you know, at night it's probably 90 right now. The golf course lights the entire place with these glow sticks, and they put them along every fairway and in every hole. And for 39 bucks, each golfer gets their own glow-in-the-dark ball. But like in the daytime, the name of the game is still getting the ball in the cup. It's fun, it's safe. Um, the only thing you have to worry about is losing your glow ball. Managers say it's all about having a good time. It's more of a casual, relaxed thing. People don't have to worry so much about their golf swing in the dark, really. Uh, nobody can see it anyways. You, know, you play every day and you can see the pins, you can see your distances, and this is just totally different. And this golfer says he just can't get enough of it. I'll be out here next month, without a doubt. A new twist to a centuries-old game. In Phoenix, Maxine Park, Cronkite News. Golf courses around the valley take turns hosting night golf. It happens about once a month. Check with your favorite golf course to see if they're hosting it. I have really pretty bad night vision, so I don't think you're going to find me on the course at night, but meet me there during the day. I'm not even good at golf. <laughs>